Hi guys, all signs it is for me. So, this is going to be an all signs read one. What are we gonna do with this one? Hmm. What's new? We're not gonna be talking about anything from the past. We're gonna be talking about something new. All the new. And I'm not talking about anybody that's in your life right now. I'm strictly talking about who's coming up next after that person. If you are already in a relationship and everything is good, this is not for you. If you're not looking for anybody or you're not dating or, you know, you're hiding up under a rock, this is not for you. This is for my people. Ooh. Spirit say yes it is. So if you're hiding up under a rock, this might be for you too. So... Um, yeah, so, but, yeah, you kind of get the gist of it. This is going to be the new new, not the person that you're trying to, um, stick on to, not somebody that you've been talking to. No, this is the new new, the next one. Okay, thank you guys for tuning in to my channel. Please keep in mind that these readings are general, may or may not resonate. I'm going to start with Aries, of course, ending with Pisces, and more than likely a collective. If someone could please leave the timestamps below, I would graciously appreciate that. Appreciate that. <laughs> yeah, that part. Okay. All right, Spirit. Give me some energy from my Aries. Aries, what is new? What's new for my Aries? Being single, going out partying, <laughs> or just dealing with a lot of people, like just taking on the energy of being single. Could be potentially three people, but this would be three people, not including yourself, that are gonna be coming to you wanting to, you know, hang. All right, give me a little bit more insight. Yep, you're going to be happy as hell and toxic. <laughs> but whoever this resonates with. <laughs> Tell the cops you're going to be happy as hell. Oh my God, bye Aries. That's just like an Aries. I'm just going I'm just going to do what I want to do at this point. Okay, so what's coming up next? Okay, who do we have? Taurus. What's, what's the new for Taurus? What is the new for Taurus? Ah, Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. All right. Okay, let's talk about this, Taurus. You gotta... <laughs> when these new people come in... You got to let your guard down a little bit, baby, okay? I know you probably been wounded by some past situations, but you cannot get anywhere being stuck in your head, okay? I don't know what the hell you waiting for. You just sitting there, okay? This person, whoever that's coming in, can't get to you because you're stuck. <sighs> Tell me why Taurus is stuck and waiting for something. Okay, so because you're still stuck on this past person, Taurus. Let me tell you something real quick. This is the new spread, okay? Which means the old person is not allowed back. Bye, Taurus. You got to figure that out, baby. All right, Gemini. What's going on for my Geminis? What's going on? What's going on? Ooh. So... <laughs> Guard it. Gemini, you have somebody new coming in that would love to be with you. Um, but I feel like you'll be rejecting this person. And we're gonna find out why. But whoever you are rejecting was could have been or is gonna be the one. Oh, because they gonna say some shit that's gonna make you be like, eh, -eh I don't like it. I got the king of night oh oh this person exhibits some past energy from the past people here the knight of wands this person is going to be okay so you know that this person is already inconsistent i take that back if that motherfucker can't sit still for you he don't deserve you bye <laughs> i don't care how much you love me i need you to sit still until i tell you to get up <laughs> that's the aries in me 
<laughs> Bye, Gemini. Okay, Cancel. What's coming in new for you? Maybe it's Sagittarius, but um, I feel like this person has a lot of burdens. They're just getting, they're just getting out of something. Yeah, with the Ten of Swords, they just went through a breakup. They might still be a little closed off because of whatever they went through in their past. Tell me more. Yeah, they're still at a crossroads, so they don't even know whether or not they're going to go back to this past person or not. So, yeah, Cancer, I don't know. I don't know if you really don't want to deal with them. I hear they'll be a little fickle, so you won't be able to really grasp this person as much as you would like to. Okay, Spirit, what's up with my Leo gang? What they got coming in? Ooh, somebody that's going to be giving them mutual love. Okay. Yeah, they're going to want to work with you. This person is going to be putting in the work, I heard. Okay. So, Spirit, tell me more about this person. I like it. Yeah. So, this person is going to be wanting to put on the work. They're going to love you. They're going, they're going to think the world of you. However, this is you here being guarded. You know, really holding back. A little dark. You hear the sirens? That's for y'all. That's symbolic. Y'all are going to be holding back from this person, and I feel like it's because of something that happened in your past. But let me tell you something. Again, you and the motherfucking Taurus, if y'all cannot get out of y'all heads and get happy with somebody, you're going to be by yourself long as you decide to stay stuck, you'll be stuck. Bye. So who's going to be next up in this piece? Virgo. Virgo. Somebody, it could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This person is rushing in. They're going to be really fast. Um, definitely could be a Gemini, but I feel like this person is going to have a really deep connection with you. Mm. It's either a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or... Um, a Cancer Pisces Scorpio it doesn't necessarily have to be their sun sign, which is a sign that they're born with. It could be in their moon rising or sun, I mean, moon rising or Venus. Um, but this person has a lot of love for you. Yeah, I feel like they're going to be wanting to manifest. With it. Ooh, Ten of Cups. I feel like this person is going to want to manifest something with you. Four of Cups, they're waiting. They're waiting. This person probably been looking at you like, ooh, Snack Yana or Snackster. But all when you're ready baby okay libra what's going on for my libra gang could be a pisces coming in but i feel like this person is going to cause a little bit of conflict hell yeah this person is going to come shake up the room i don't know what this person is doing but they definitely doing it all right why what's going on with this person Because they're they're trying to walk away from some type of heartbreak, so this person might not be that communi communicative with you, and I feel like that's a problem for Libra because you gotta talk to them. Mm -hmm. Or this could be you if you're just getting out of something and you feeling like you don't want to give your all right now, Libra. How the fuck is somebody gonna talk to a brick wall? Okay. Next, Scorpio. Who is coming in for my Scorpio? What's the new? Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus definitely could be a Capricorn, but this motherfucker got issues. Yeah, they might already have a family. Be on the lookout for that. There's some toxicity here. Definitely could be a Capricorn. Or they're just operating from their shadow side. This person could be someone that you work with. <clears throat> if it's not someone that you work with, then this is going to be someone who is uh, really good with money. An entrepreneur, a business person, business woman, business man. This person is uh, very good with finances. This person is really good with equity and dealing with um, any any situation and where you're trying to grow. Yeah, I feel like this person... Okay, so it could also be a cancer, but I feel like this person... Um, mm, this person already has a family. Yeah, Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. This person is already married. But with the Ace of Pentacles, they're going to be trying to offer you something. Yeah, but I feel like you already intuitively know this person is uh, on some bullshit. 
All right, bye guys. So, Sagis. Sagis. Hello, Sagis. Y'all like, don't talk to me like that. Y'all like the babies that you can't talk baby talk to. <laughs> Oh, Ten of Cups. Ooh, could be a Leo coming in. But somebody is coming in to make you very happy. I feel like there'll be some very deep emotions here. Um, this person might not be uh, telling you that right off the back. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They might not tell you like, ooh, my God, I'm so in love with you. Yeah, but they are. With the Queen of Cups and the Knight of Coins, they're coming in to offer you something solid, baby. Yes, they're, they're going to rush in, too. They're going to come out of nowhere with this fucking Knight of Swords. You might tell them, like, slow the fuck down. I just heard that. Like, <laughs> halt. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, so, ooh, not yet, not yet, Spirit. Capricorns. Capricorns. What we got for my Capricorns? What's going to be happening for my Capricorns? What's the new? Oh, it could be a, a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, but I see this person going to be stressing you the fuck out. I feel like they might work a lot. <clears throat> and you might not be that trustworthy with people and what they say right now, especially after a period of going through some things. Yeah, yeah, this person doesn't talk to you like that. And that creates a lot of drama for you because you feel like you're always waiting. So just be on the lookout for that. This person doesn't necessarily have to have someone else. Everybody is not going to be cheating on you, Capricorn. Some people actually have other things to do. All right, bye, Cappy. Gotta get some trust. Okay, Aquarius. Aquarius. So... What's going on with you today? Okay, so Aquarius, I feel like there could be a, a Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius coming in. Um, with the hangman, I feel like this person is going to make you look at life from a new perspective. It, we have you at the bottom of the deck here with the king of swords. So, yeah. This person is going to make you think what they find is. I'm definitely not going to take that. Okay, so what is this person going to be making my Aquarius think about? A new start. You're going to be looking at this person like, you made me want to be the one I'm with. And start a new relationship with you. This is what you do. Yeah, queen. This is your queen of swords to your king of swords. Guys, look at this. Different decks. The queen and the king, okay? All right. Bye. Could be another air sign person sexy though okay pisces 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 what's going on with my pisces oh shit so if there's a player rushing into you real in and out energy this person's going to be juggling um i feel like they're going to be bringing the drama might want to keep their panties up for this one mm -hmm. i just see too much shit with them okay tell me more spirit yeah, you're going to have to make a decision about this one quick because they coming in for the sex. And I feel like you feel like there's a great connection with this person, but ugh, you might want to sit this one out. Okay. So, collective. For my collectives. Let's see what's going on with my collective. All right, so collective. We have a decision here with a strong bond something that you might have been really trying to manifest but um let's just say yeah this is going to be something that you're going to have to hold off from right now because it's too confusing i feel like um if you're done it could be an aries leo sagittarius cancer pisces scorpio capricorn virgo or taurus but or a gemini here but this person is like um They're going to be holding off or holding back from you. Like, in the Page of Cups, you know, there's a, a fish inside the cup. This man doesn't have a fish. I'm sorry, it's so dark. This person doesn't have a fish inside their cup because they're not really offering you much. They're, they're just, like, aloof. But they're here. It's like, I just showed up to the party. 
Yeah, because this person is focused on themselves. They might be trying to work on finding a place to stay. Yeah, they might even... They, they're not going to tell you that, but I feel like intuitively you'll know something that's up with this person. Yeah, they just got out of a relationship with the Ten of Cups to the uh, Will of Fortune. They needed to... Um, they, they're trying to realign themselves, so they're not ready yet. Yeah, they're still very conflicted about what happened in the past. All right, you guys. Bye.